So you're going to take a number 10 O-ring if you lose this O-ring. And you don't need to take your, your breech off your gun. I just have a gun that's taken apart. And what you're going to do is, inside that breech, I mean inside the barrel, there is a... Um, Uh, that's terrible right there that's where the o-ring goes where it's kind of dull right there that's the o-ring slot so the best thing to do when doing this is to lube your o-ring in 100 percent silicon grease and again it's a number 10 so if you go to a harbor freight and get one of their um their um o-ring cases you can find all this so lube this up and what you're going to do is you're going to work it in there first and see how it's going it's, I got it kind of going in right now there it is right there you're gonna it, it's right right now sitting in the right side of the groove if you push the other side in and they get something like a little dental pick and then push it right there it's seated so just push your, your bolt in Pull your bolt back out, make sure it's seated, and just don't dry fire your rifle anymore with the bolt open. Because every time you do that, you'll lose the O-ring, but it's easy. So when it comes out, take a number 10 O-ring, lube it up, push it in there. So one side gets started, and then push the entire O-ring in where it's just sitting there, and then take a pick, and just push it in until it sets in that groove. Slide your bolt back and forth to make sure it's in there and that's it. Hope that helps.